to today's video everybody and today is going to be a tour of my vanity and I hope that you enjoy this video I love you so much a few moments later and then just real techniques this is all my tools this is all my face stuff can see that my contour and my foundation my backup foundation if that one runs out this is in warm nude california blush mac strobe cream benefit what's up and then my jeffrey's up powder all of that i use this more of a body mist because um otherwise it's too wet to use on the face so i just use this as a body mist instead of something for the face mist on my collarbones and my shoulders and all that because it's better that way. Bucks, my Lily Lashes, my Lily Lashes in Mykonos, my Browsings, my Better Than Sex Mascara um, and yeah everything there and then this is all my beautiful Holy Grail makeup lip products. Gloss that I'm using literally every day. I love it so much. It's so gorgeous. This is all of my palettes that I have right now. I have the Neutrogena makeup wipes. I'm not playing around in this quarantine. This is a body mist my best friend gave to me. It smells amazing, like passion fruits. I have the trial size of this Tatcha cleansing oil because I use it at night and you can never have too much Tatcha in your life. Jeffree Star Cosmetics bag. It's iconic on the go. I always take it to um, when I'm shooting on set and top myself up. I've got my Kiss nails. I probably will be wearing these right now. Um, I've got some lashes and some body mist. I mean, body mist, body lotion, uh, hair dryer that I use clean. Hello, if you know, you know. It's my conspiracy palette because I love it. And my favorite little part is this candle, which is really cute. The other candle which I love so much. I know it needs to clean the front of this candle, but hi. So together, hi everybody, welcome to my video. These are all my palettes and I'm about to go through them all. So first up is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Kit. I use this in every makeup tutorial that I've ever made. Girl, I need to get these nails done. I think I already mentioned this, but okay. And then we have the Naked Urban Decay Cherry Palette, which I don't use as often because I feel like it's more of a seasonal thing. But I do love this palette nonetheless, and I will be keeping this forever for myself because I love it. It's so stunning. Rose Gold Palette by Huda Beauty. I don't use this brand anymore um, just because I don't like her as a person, so... I don't really use her anymore, but you know, I have used these palettes quite a few times. Um, and then we have a Too Faced palette, super fun night. It's a cute palette, it's got some nice colors, quite blendable. It's kind of cute. And then we have my favorite, I'm with the 24A Artist Path palette by Morphe, which I think is the most iconic palette that I own. And I love it so much. And I have just done a video on this and everyone loved it, so I might do another one creating three other different looks. Let me know in the comments down below. Comments down below if you want to see that. My iconic Jeffree Star mirror. Hi, how are ya? And then you have that 35i IC Fantasy palette by Morphe. I'm not gonna get this out because like I don't like it. <laughs> um, yeah, no. The colors are not good. And then the James Charles palette, which I really don't know what to do with. Like, I honestly can't sell a used palette. I don't like this palette anymore. I don't use it anymore. I don't support the creator, so I don't like, it just kind of just sits here and it's kind of sad. Like, it just sits here by itself and just like doesn't do anything. So then it's just like, okay, cool. So I just kind of place it there. I'll occasionally use it if I really seriously need to get like a last resort eyebrow highlight. But other than that, I don't even use that palette anymore. Like, it's just not my priority, you know? Just not my bag, you know? It is not my thing. I don't really 
tend to try and use palettes like that or support people like that. So, you know, not trying to diss him, but you know. I got this card from Tarcha. I love Tarcha, it's the most iconic brand ever for your skin. So good. Dear Lily, wishing you a lifetime of petal pure skin that blooms with radiance. Always Tarcha. I'm obsessed with Tarcha. I think I'm going to use it until I'm on this earth no longer. But I love it so much. My conspiracy palette, my iconic fragrances, which I all love. I keep saying iconic so much because that's what they are. And then my beautiful candle, which complements the whole room. And this is the whole of the vanity. And I hope you like it. And I've been bored today. So I started to make a custom background for myself. This took me about 10, 15 minutes. And I created all of this myself on PicMonkey. And yeah, if you want a custom background, let me know in, in the comments down below. I can make you some custom backgrounds if you would like during this time. Um, or just in general, I love doing it. And I also did some channel art for my channel, which I will show you right now. From PicMonkey, and I just did that myself. I love it so much. I've always, always ranting and raving about being the best version of yourself. And I could not agree more with that, um, with this current situation right now, just in general. I just want you guys to be the best version of yourself and I hope that you will always be that. They are perfect for movie nights. And I am about to go watch Sleeping Beauty on Disney Plus because hi, it's me, it looks like me. And yeah, that's my life. So I'm gonna go watch that. Um, I hope that you enjoyed this video today and give it a big, like, thumbs up, comment, subscribe. I love you all. I see you all. I love you. And I'll see you in the next video.